I still don't have nowhere to go. Gina is a resident of the safe ground site on X Street. As construction moves in, the city is slowly trying to move her and others out of this site into shelters, motels, and reconnecting them with family. I'm going to continue to stay right here. Um, couch I want they place back, but um, I've been here almost a year. Over the past couple of weeks, and even just today while we've been here, you can see people loading things up, but where exactly they're moving to is the question that we can't quite get answered. We reached out to multiple leaders heading this project, including Council Member Valenzuela, Mayor Steinberg, and Bridget Dean, the Director of the Department of Community Response. They all turned us down for an interview. But City Public Information Officer Greg Fishman told me on the phone that the WX safe ground site was never meant to be a final living place for folks. The WX site has served around 450 people since opening in April. It's now down to about 45. Their goal is to evacuate everyone by the end of the year, and he couldn't give us any information on the new site as it's not 100% set yet. A source at Loaves and Fishes told us finding new sites for these types of camps is difficult, as neighboring communities and businesses often complain. This community over here is a safety hazard. It's something advocate Alonzo Assel attests to. What is a damn, I mean, rat doing running out the grass eating stuff over here? I've been over here since 85. I ain't never seen no rats. He's especially worried as coronavirus cases surge nationwide. Moving them in a motel, getting them off the streets will save lives. And ABC 10 will continue to push for answers on this story to find out where exactly the new safe ground site will be located and available.